Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Nikki. Thank you for coming back today. Thank you for joining me for another video, guys. I always love to see your pretty little faces. So please do comment, subscribe, all that good stuff down below. Please get connected with me and join me for future videos. So guys, I'm um, joining on the bandwagon for the black bag tag. I wasn't tagged by anyone directly that I can think of, but... I've seen other people do it, and I will admit right away, guys, black bags are not my, um, I'm not initially drawn to them, let's put it like that. I think black is great because it goes with everything, of course, it's the chief neutral on the list, um, but for me, I like to be more softer with my bags, so a lot of my neutral bags, if I'm going to buy a neutral one, it's going to be a type of brown. But I do have just a few black that I want to share with you guys in my collection. So here we go. Um, here's the first one. And I want to say this is the Michael Kors Jet Set Patent Tote. Or it's a Jet Set Tote and it's in the patent leather. Um, guys, this was a gift from my DH, my dear husband. And um, he gave this to me a couple of Christmases ago. And I love this bag. Um, it's... Sometimes it's a little bit much just because it's so shiny. You know, you can see it a mile away and I'm not normally about that. I will carry this bag typically um, maybe to an event, maybe, you know, traveling or something like that. I'll use this bag, but um, I will never get rid of it because it was a gift from him. It was actually like, I think the second bag he ever bought me. So Michael Kors Jet Set Tote in the patent leather. First black bag. The next one coming up you have seen here on my channel and it's another bag that um, it's uh, heavily used. It didn't make my five most used list, but it was probably number six if I would have had a number six. And this is the Michael Kors Gathered Tote. And this is in the black, um, is this the black monogram for Michael Kors in silver hardware. This is another big black bag. I have the, the matching wallet with this and... Because it's a black bag in the inside, it's so hard to find things sometimes. This bag is dark, guys. You probably can't see right now because I do have it stuffed with some MK paper. But it is really, it is dark in there. And it's, you know, so I, a lot of times when I use this, I do use it for a long period of time. But, you know, not all the time. So, uh, Michael Kors Jet Set Gather Tote in the black monogram. Number three is a newer, newer member. I've had it for a few months now. You guys remember when I reviewed or hauled this bag a little bit a while ago. And this is the Rebecca Minkoff Amorous Tote. This is, or Amorous Satchel, I should say. Amorous Satchel. Um, this bag is the only Rebecca Minkoff piece in my collection. Um, and it is my only you know, satchel of any kind from her or anything like that. So I'm really um, excited about this. It's opened me up to Rebecca Minkoff. I'm actually looking right now at another Rebecca Minkoff bag and see if I can't find it um, somewhere because this one is so nice and I really do like this bag. So here we go. The, the Rebecca Minkoff Amorous Satchel in black. Really nice. And here are some, there are two, um, I would like to call these two honorable mention black bags in my collection. Um, it has come up for debate between me and my husband whether this bag is considered a black bag. But to me, it's considered my black bag, my black tote, I should say. And this is the Greta, is it the Greta Shopper? Dooney and Burke or the Leisure Shopper, Leisure Shopper, I'm sorry. The Dooney and Burke Leisure Shopper, Leisure Shopper. And this is in the black and uh, brown Dooney and Burke. And I consider this to be like my black tote because it is a dark, dark. Maybe you could call it an off black. That could be a, a, a accurate uh, description here. But it serves as a, as a black. You know, you look at it from a distance and it looks black. So I like this for shopping, obviously. It's a tote. Um, and it is definitely a workhorse bag. You can do anything to this bag and it really does survive. So Dooney and Burke Leisure Shopper serving as my black tote. And the second and last bag to be shown is another honorable mention bag. And the reason I show this bag is because 
um, I consider, even though this has another color on it, I consider this to be like one of my black bags because black is kind of the theme of this bag. And this is my Michael Kors Selma, large Selma. And this is the, um, I want to say this is like the color block Selma. I think that's what it's called. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong, but it is the Michael Kors Selma. And this is black, mostly on the inside, black on the side. And it does have the red here, but I like to use this as like a, like a black bag because I feel like the red is my pop of color. If I want to wear like an all black outfit, I would definitely carry this. Or if I wanted to wear something that was black themed this would be a bag that i would carry so this is an honorable mention bag um i understand it's not completely black but like i said i don't have a large black bag collection because i tend to gear towards the softer brown browns you know flavors of brown and everything and navy and things like that so guys that is my small but lovely handbag collection for black bags thank you for coming to my channel today be sure to like share subscribe comment down below talk to me everywhere and i will see you in my next video Bye bye